Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday, and I am Crafty Jackie. Welcome back to my channel. I'm glad to see you, and I hope you're glad to see me. We didn't go to church today because it was outside. I look out the window, and it's all very kind of hazy and mucky. Uh, I think part of it is that smoke from Canada. Part of it is... um. Uh, what do you call it? And there's a damn fly. Tarn fly. Um, uh, pollen. Pollen. And I'm telling you, it's, <clears throat> it's nasty out. As far as the air goes. It's not nasty because it's summertime. Well, I have a very <laughs> mixed haul here. I have, uh, a Timu. Uh, and I have a Goodwill haul. And the Timu is kind of mixed. Uh, it's gotten kind of conglomerated. I don't know. I can't remember what I've shown you, what I've not. So I'm going to go with what I think I haven't shown you. And I'm going to get all this stuff cleared out today because I have another... Timu Hall or to do tomorrow. I'm, I'm getting stuff tomorrow. Um, I'll show you the first thing I got because it's sitting right here. Um, I got this necklace. Yep. For free. I don't recall what I did. I probably had to sell my soul to the devil. But I, I wanted it because it's my opal is my birthstone, but so is pink zirconia. And so I thought that was kind of pretty. The chain is nice enough, but it's too short. So luckily I do have some longer chains. So that I got for free. For free! I think I'm going to start here with my uh, Goodwill. So, um, there's some pretty cool stuff in it. I went on a day that wasn't a sale day, and I thought I'd see what I could find when there's not a half price thing going on. And I wanted to see... I still have all the stickers on. I wanted to see what all right. It says National Potteries, Cleveland, Ohio, class division eleven oh three. Glass division eleven oh three. And it's one of those, um, I don't know the name of the pattern, but it's rings like this. And there was no um, chips or anything that I could find, which I thought was rather nice. And it's a nice big thing. It would look gorgeous with, um, well, it would look really pretty with summer flowers, like daisies or something. But at Christmas time, it would be so pretty with uh, poinsettias. So... I got that. You know, go big or go home. <clears throat> I think a total I spent $30. All right. I'm going to do this. The next thing I got was this hand-blown LED glass globe. Um, it's an ornament, and it lights up with color-changing LEDs. Uh, it does have ba batteries in it. I thought I'd show you this. And this is in a glass globe. That is 
you don't see snowflakes on it. I thought it was very pretty. You know, I don't even know if it's an ornament. I think it's just a globe, like a decoration piece. And um, I was going to tell you that uh, sometime in July, we'll have a Christmas in July sale. I always do when, when Hallmark has their sale or their, you know, their Looney Tunes week month. My daughter keeps going, I don't believe they're going to put Christmas on. I said, Sarah, I like it. Don't kill my, don't kill me. And this, oh, I thought this was so pretty. It is this blown glass, um, basket the bottom of it is all smooth the ponto has been smoothed off but it's all like crinkly it's not like crackle glass it's like crinkly it's hard to explain but it's cobalt blue and it's got the clear handle And I thought it was real pretty. For of us cobalt blue lovers, it's pretty. <clears throat> I was cutting, <clears throat> I think veggies. I've been, we've been having a lot of veggies. Not that it's helped me any, but we have been. And I had Sharpened my knife really good. Well, as I was going, I sliced the tip of my thumb off. Not like a lot, but oh my God, it's this thing hurt. I didn't realize how much you used your thumb until I did that. <laughs> it has been owie. And this I got, um, it doesn't have the sticker on it anymore. It's not stamped or anything, but I know it's, um, uh, uh, what do you call it? Party light because I've got the hanging candle thing. And I thought you could, you, you could put a taper in here, but I thought you could also do it like this and put a big, you know, other candle on it. So... Pet not a pedestal candle, a pillar candle. So, very pretty. I gotta move this a little bit. It's, it's kind of goofy. And there's no cracks or anything. <clears throat> I didn't take the tape off this, but I will now. Mm. But it's this pretty little seashell drinking dish. And it's red velvet on the inside. And I thought it was very pretty, very summery looking. I think everything's going to feel summery pretty soon. I, I feel sorry for some of these people in Texas. That's just sad. It's so hot. 
Now, the weird thing is, I could have sworn I got a lot more stuff. Um, but this is all that made it in here, so I don't know. And this next thing. They almost had to call the ambulance for me. I've never found one. Ever. I found one. A clear glass. And uh, it's in good condition. Flower frog. And uh, it's a big one. I mean, it's a really big one. So that will be in the sale, in a sale. Because I do not collect them. I have a couple, about three of the ones with the wire prongs. But I don't collect them. That just happens to be. I do use them in my decorating but <clears throat> oh, I didn't put it off. I've been watching a lot of uh, crafting stuff on YouTube because I'm getting bored. Oh my gosh, what's this? Oh, you know, I'm, I'm sure I had more stuff. Because I had another base. Yeah. It's, it's somewhere. But I found this base. I thought this was really cool. I'm going to have to do some. I can't figure out how to... Uh, describe it to find it but it looks like a snowman almost but it is so pretty and you know I think if you put fairy lights or something in it that it would be real real pretty with all with all these facets I think it would be gorgeous it is heavy 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 yeah I'm sure I got another base and some other stuff. So I don't know what happened to it. Things don't ever make it out of our van. They don't make it in, in to the room I say to take it to. It's just been a a real crap show here lately. So that's the way it goes. So that is That is the um, stuff I got at Goodwill, to the best of my knowledge. And then this is a bunch of slippers and shoes that some I'm getting rid of. They don't fit me anymore and some I'm keeping. So, like these Mentonkas, they're brand new. I bought them off, of, I bought them from eBay, but they don't fit right. I don't want size even. I love the Minnetonkas. Minnetonka, however. Say it. Oh, here it is. It's a size seven. I'm not sure what's wrong with them. Oh, well, we'll, we'll figure it out. So, let me see here. Um, <clears throat> got a couple of pair of sandals. These are beautiful. They are so comfortable. And they look really, really cute on. So... I'm really happy with these. 
And then I got these. Oops, wrong thing. These right here. And they're a slight platform. It's like you're walking on pillows. It's almost kind of dangerous. I should have got the ones that were platform. But I'll probably get used to them. So, I got them. Uh, I got this because I saw lots and lots of people buying them. And I got to tell you. If you have a problem with being a wet head, you know, where your head's always sweaty, this is the thing they have. They came in all kinds of colors, but of course, you know me, I got pink. It comes with a USB charger. So you either got to plug it into the one that you would use for your phone or something like that. And it took me forever to find the little button. Here it is right here. So uh, put it on. And it's got three settings. This is low. I'll probably be wearing it today. This is medium. And that's high. And that's keeping my head cool. And my face. You know, it goes to my face. Yep. Well, it's got a little light to tell you it's charged. And I, I don't remember how much it was. It was definitely less than $10. And the little charging cord is in here too. I'm sure it was less than $10. All right. Uh, some things have already been put places, so that's why I don't know, you know, those kind of things happen. I got this stand to use for my, um, uh, I don't have an iPad. I have, um, a Kindle Fire, I think it's called, but to hold my, um, my um Kindle Fire so if I'm reading on it or anything or I can use it for sales uh, you know it has a stand I have a a cover that goes into a stand but this is a lot more sturdy I'm trying not to, to keep buying everything just at random but finding things that I think would be useful. Now, I bought this. Since Ron continues to smoke, and these fools are always, they have bought these um, plastic, I think they sell them at Dollar Tree. They sell them a lot of places. But they sell them at Dollar Tree, and they fit in your cup holder in your car. Well, I got, whoa, I got this one. It's metal. And, uh, I just thought it looked a lot nicer. Um, but I also got one. It looks kind of like a little urn. It's got a top, uh, lid on it. And it has a thing that goes in the center that you could put your, you know, your cigarette out and then just drop it in the thing. But I took that thing out and I filled it with sand, um, the decorative sand, like uh, I bought it at uh, Dollar Tree. I don't know if you, any of you remember, but years ago they had ashtrays in like stores and stuff. Like if you were going to go on the elevator, they'd have the ashtray with the sand so you had to put your cigarette out or they had them outside so i put sand in it and they could just stick it in there and then uh when it gets full we can just sift them out you know and it has the lid so it won't ever get wet 
So that was one of the things I bought. Because I'm nice like that. Even though I don't want them to smoke. And I certainly don't want Ron to smoke when I'm in the car with them. But that's the way it is. All right. Especially when I can't read that. So... Um, this is one of the pair of reading glasses I got. They're really nice. They're the spring-loaded, like, regular glasses. And, uh, yeah. They're nice. Now, I want to say... Alright. That's all in that bag. So, I'm going to turn this way. find this bag and I know I knew I had it because I did take a top out and wear it but I could not find this yesterday I, I couldn't find this and I couldn't find the um, um I can't remember anything anymore the my um stand to put my phone on so, it's kind of hard to do a sale without <coughs> the stuff and the sand, the tripod. So, I didn't have the sale till today. <laughs> and it made me really mad. The top that I wore, wore the, I wore the Friday night. We went to a Mexican restaurant called El Taco Real and it's uh, from the area where I grew up so me and Ron were riding around looking at stuff after we ate but we met um, we went with Sarah and Doug and we met his uncle at the restaurant and we ate and he paid for everything which I thought was very nice man I wish I brought a drink in here Wow, I'm thirsty. And anyway, so the top I wore was I had on black pants and I had um uh, it's like a buffalo check pink and black buffalo check top. Everybody calls it plaid. It's buffalo check. Plaid is when there's like several colors running through. Now this top I thought looked very pretty in the picture, but it doesn't look as fancy as it did in the picture. Now I'm not gonna say it doesn't, it won't be pretty, but it is, and I got everything real big, really big, cause I don't want it to be too small. I don't want it to be tight. I think I'm retaining fluid somewhat from my um being on prednisone so i'm on prednisone again that will help my breathing eventually but it's also jacking up my blood sugar so it's going to probably make me a diabetic so it isn't one thing it's another but anyway i got this top right here it's really long should i go wear it for a dress <laughs> I lost an inch, so it's going to be a lot easier. <laughs> I don't mean to be rushing with the clothes. All right. I got one shirt. It didn't fit me. Ron's did fit him, but mine didn't fit me. So it says something about being born in the 60s. So uh, I'm going to give it to Rocky. And I told him, I says, I got a shirt for you. I says, but it's kind of lavender. <laughs> and he said, I said, but you'll like it anyway. It's really cool. 
And this one is a tank top. Just a plain old tank top. it will be worn this week I have lots of tank tops and they will be worn a lot from here on out I'm sure what you doing a haul Big old haul I'm hauling I've, I finally found my stuff so. and then I got this one and it feels like crepe but I didn't really look at it too closely yeah but it's so cute with the buttons and everything and then it's got the flowers I don't like that they're painted on but wait all right I'm gonna see what the materials made of Cotton and polyester. It's mostly cotton. Good thing I got it bigger. Because you never know. Okay. I'll have to watch. Somebody will wash it hot or put it on a hot dryer. All right. That's the next one. Yeah, I should have brought my drink. I've got two things to drink in the living room. This one, I think, is so pretty. It's, uh... I just love the look of it. Let me see what the skinny is on the material. Polyester and span. Band. I'm wearing these spandex. Yep, I love this one. The order I'm getting Monday. I can't remember. There's some clothes. I got to cut down. I, I'm cutting down on the clothes. I'm just, I got nuts. So I cut down and I got, I did get two more dresses. I've already worn one of them. Now this, um, I got to go with something. I had gotten from um, Poodle some plaster elephants. She bought them at a sale at a Vintage Finney's sale. Well, this they had, and I have it in my bath, the elephants in my bathroom. I don't like them. I just want to put them. I love them. I can see them from in here. Because bathroom's just over there. And so I found these, and you put it on the tank of the toilet, and it says, please flush. And it's blue, just like the elephants. So I said, I got to get that. I have got to get that and put it on my toilet tank. I'm kind of half tempted not to because we're supposed to get another toilet toilet tank, but I guess I could take it off and put it on another one. I don't know. And that is a Timu wrap. If you haven't ordered from Timu yet, they've got everything. I mean, they have got everything. And I watch, I watch people's hauls and I see things I've never seen before. And I've got to hunt and hunt and hunt to find them. I mean, it's just there's so much. And you can type something in and it won't even come up. Um, I'll explain that further in a um, 
Oh, there's a birdie on my swing. Um, in one of my upcoming uh, videos. So anyway, um, they have everything. Pretty much everything. Uh, I'm going to be making some curtains for Sarah's camper. She's supposed to be helping me. And we're going to just do, um, I have some of those squares right here. We're going to just do um, you know, like a I don't know what you call it. Cranny quilt, maybe? I'm not sure what you call it. And that's what the curtains are going to look like that face in. On Timo, I found these quilted blankets that I can get and, and cut to, you know, put the curtains to back them. And then I'll hand stitch some kind of stuff on them if I got time. Otherwise, we're going to have to do it on a machine. But, um... Yeah, so that, I found that, and I was real happy to, that I found that. So, um, it's just amazing. I don't have a special code, but I know several people do. Uh, Misty does. Um, uh, Alex does. But there's a few people. So if you've never ordered and you think that you might like to, uh, if you get their code, you'd get 30% off of your first order. And um, I would think that's well worth it. Now, like I said, people, I've heard a couple of people saying that the prices have been raised, but I'd, I don't, don't notice it too much, but then I'm not, I'm not a shopper like that. I don't shop that much normally. But for me, convenience is one of the things because I've virtually got um, many stores at my fingertips. And uh, I can, you know, if I don't mind waiting a couple of weeks, because that's about all it takes, then I can get it and I have it. Um, I mean, you can't get furniture, you can't get big appliances. But you can get um, you know you can get um, smaller you know like counter appliances you can get uh, I got a glue gun because I burn up my other one <laughs> I left it plugged in I try not to let Ron find that find out about that I was going to go back in there and work and I got sidetracked by something else. But, um, you know, and they're crafting stuff. Unbelievable. If you are a crafter or if you just like jewelry, they're costume jewelry. Unbelievable. They have wigs. I'm going to venture out and buy myself one wig, one or try it just so that if I feel like being a little different, I'll have a different wig. Michael Curley. Um, anyway, it, it's just, it, it's a fun thing to shop. You just have to be careful and not be a bozo and spend every bit of your money on, you know, on Timu. Because it, it could happen if you're not careful. So, guys, I, um, I'm so glad you came to see me. And uh, I hope you're having a great day. I miss you guys. I I like to hang with you more often. I'm trying. If I quit losing my, <laughs> my stuff. But I'll try not to lose it anymore. And uh, so I will see you soon. And uh, well, it's Sunday, so... I guess I'll see you tomorrow. And uh, you behave yourselves. Have a blessed Sunday. Relax. Rest. It's what we're supposed to do on Sunday. We're supposed to be in the Sabbath and 
to rest. I love you guys. Take care.